Yellowstone supervolcano is hit by a record-breaking mega swarm of 1,200 earthquakes in just one month. Since the swarm began June 12, there have been a total of 1,284 earthquakes. They've continued to monitor its activity. The largest so far was magnitude 4.4. Still, the experts say the risk of an eruption remains low with alert level at normal. Yellowstone Park, hit by 1,200 quakes in the span of only a month, seismologists say. In the most recent update on these earthquake storms, scientists have been monitoring since June 12. The researchers say there have been 1,284 events so far, the largest with magnitude 4.4. As the activity spurred fears that the supervolcano could be gathering up, gearing up for an eruption, the experts say the risk of such an event is low and the alert level remains at normal. As the swarm continues, they will continue to monitor its activity and provide updates as seen fit. For now, though, experts have left an alert level in the green zone, meaning activity is still considered normal. If it were to erupt, the Yellowstone volcano, supervolcano, would be one of a thousand times as powerful as the 1980 Mount St. Helens eruption, although experts say the risk is low of that happening. Yellowstone has erupted for 70,000 years, so it's going to take some impressive earthquake and ground uplifting to get these things started. This is what the U.S. Geological Survey explains. Well, ground uplifting has been taking place. My last video on Yellowstone did specify that. Besides intense earthquake swarms, with many earthquakes above 4 or 5 magnitude, we expect rapid and notable uplift around the caldera, possibly tens of inches per year. Finally, the rising magma will cause explosions from the boiling temperature geothermal reservoirs. Even with explosions, earthquakes, notable up ground uplift, the most likely volcanic eruptions would be the type that would have minimal effect outside the park itself. However, if it were to blow, that would be a terrible situation. The swarm has steadily persisted over the last few weeks. In an update last month, experts revealed the swarm had reached nearly 900 quakes by June 28th. And when the earthquake started on uh, June 12th, G USGS said it was the highest number of earthquakes at the park within a single week in the past five years. I leave links below for you for this. You can read more on the USGS Volcano Hazards Program for Yellowstone. This is on Daily Mail UK.